I wonder what Bommy's up to. Bommy, what's with the huge mess? You left TNT all over the place. Wait, something doesn't seem normal. Hey guys, it's Pat and welcome back to another Minecraft video. And today it's going to be a mod showcase on the item physics mod. And guys, a ton of people asked me to review this one and I checked it out. It's actually really cool. And what it does, it changes the physics of items. And you probably have no idea what I'm talking about right now. But think about it. Normally in Minecraft, when you drop an item, it does this weird like spinny thing. It spins around in a circle and it just floats there. Well, this mod changes that and does some other really epic things too. So I'm going to grab like every weird item I can find. I try to get a lot of weird stuff, guys. And I'm going to show you what has changed here. So we're going to climb up here. I know I'm in creative mode. I want to climb the ladder anyway. So this cake, if I throw it, check this out. It like flips and then it lands flat. So it doesn't like spin and do anything weird. And it's actually like laying on the ground right now. Can pick it up once again. So it's really cool the way it works. And I'm going to toss so much stuff down here. Mushroom, toss that. Just like spins around. Do the cake one more time. That is amazing. And guys, fence and stuff like that looks so cool. Oh it, oh, it landed straight up. That was weird. Looked like it wasn't gonna. TNT next. That's like a normal block. Landed like that. So yeah, everything lands completely different and it flips around. Has a really cool animation. And basically what this mod does, it makes Minecraft a little bit more realistic. And you're gonna see like my anvil, it actually landed on its side that time, which is kind of cool. Let's take some stairs here and we'll toss them. And they flipped and landed straight side up. Get a flower. I just tried to get everything weird I could. I even have a villager. And the reason I picked this one is because they have bad trades. And it was the only way I could throw a villager. Even if he's in the spawn egg. Just flips around and lands on top of that. Okay, so I got a bunch more in here. Let's toss. I want to toss a weapon. And of course, it's enchanted. It's cooler that way. So look at the sword. It lands down like that. So yeah, really what the mod does is it changes the physics of the items. So when you drop them, they actually look really cool and not weird and strange. And now they're more realistic. Let's throw a golden apple. And finally, we'll throw a trap chest. And there we go. And yeah, sometimes they land on their sides, which I think is pretty cool. And on occasion, they look like they're going to and kind of just flip over. But I like when they land on the side like that. So once again, you can just pick up all that stuff. And everything is pretty much normal in Minecraft, except it looks a little bit different. Before we head on to anything else, guys, I got an awesome idea for something fun. I got 64 blocks of emeralds. I'm just going to get an epic view here. And we're going to toss these things all over the place. Look how cool this is. I love the animation and I love how they flip around. And they just look amazing as they land. Although I think they're coming out of my neck right now. And next up, guys, we're going to check out how items react to water. And it's changed a lot. So all this stuff on top actually floats in water. And, like, heavier stuff sinks down. So we'll go over to this little, like pond or whatever I built here and we'll toss some stuff in even a bucket of water so a bucket of water actually floats which is kind of weird it's like flipping around as you could see you'd think it would dump out that'd be a cool feature actually let's see what else we could throw here wood of course floats and the item has to be completely wood some items that have like wood in the recipe do sink down which you're gonna see in a minute but completely wood a chest and it floats wool also floats even signs you know made completely out of wood once again Feathers are going to float. Melons. And once again, some more wool. And as you can see, they kind of just like flip around at the top. It looks just like the weather mod. Except I think in that mod, everything floats. And this one, just certain items. I tried to pick some weird items that would make good examples for this, guys. I think Bommy's actually watching us. Probably wondering what we're doing here. So if you throw a block in, like a block of gold, it's going to sink. It goes right to the bottom. It doesn't like float up and kind of flip around. Although it does flip around at the bottom of the water, as you can see right there. Also got a piston, which is partially made of wood. It sinks. There's cobblestone in that recipe. Got a diamond block. TNT. I'm so sorry, Pommy, but TNT does not float. It sinks to the bottom. Obsidian. That's got to be really heavy. Jack-o'-lantern. Be cool if it, like, put it out. Became, like, a pumpkin. This one, an anvil, has to be really, really heavy. So that thing, it sinks right down there. And even a sponge. And I was thinking about it. A sponge, you know, it soaks up water and maybe that's why it like sinks. I have no idea. Never tried to make a sponge float. But as you can see in this mod, it is sinking down to the bottom. Alright guys, so Bommy is going to be helping us with the next section of the mod. And it's going to be how items react to lava. And this is my favorite part because some of this helps you in survival situations. Everything else, you know, it kind of just looks cool. I like how they land on the ground. It looks epic. 
But in here, guys, we got some stuff that is going to burn in lava and things that will not burn. So basically, wood and wool are going to burn horribly bad. Got the item destroyer right here, which Bami is looking over for us. So, Bami, what we're going to do is we're going to toss everything in. I'll just throw it in here. And the way I set it up is so if they do survive, it's going to fall through. So I put the signs right there. So I'm going to take all this stuff, toss it in. And you can see, like, the smoke effect to it. It's gone. Once this stuff goes in, it's never coming back. But things that aren't wood and wool, pretty much everything is going to survive. So right here, I got some, like, weird examples. Even a flower, which makes absolutely no sense, is going to survive this. So if I throw this in, they might want to change this one. A flower is going to go through and be just fine. Land it on the bottom there. So we got, like, diamonds, emeralds, stuff like that. And all this stuff, it's going to fly right through and end out back at the bottom. Oh, you know what would be a perfect example? And this is actually why I really like this. Is because if you die next to lava, all your armor falls into it. With this mod, it's actually going to be at the bottom of the lava. You could actually just pick it right back up after. So, we'll toss this thing in. And my chest plate, it's fine. That is so cool. Normally, if you die in lava, you lose everything. But with this mod, stuff that wouldn't normally burn is actually going to be okay. And the last thing we're going to check out is the cactus. And normally in vanilla Minecraft, if something lands on a cactus, it's actually gone, which is a bad thing. Cactuses are evil. They're so evil. Oh, God, it grew right in front of my face. That's how I know they're evil. That's how I can tell. But, yeah, now whenever something hits a cactus, it's not going to break. It's not going to die. And I got some cool stuff here. So let's see what we can do. Got TNT. Bobby's going to love this. It's fine. It just bounces right off. So anything that hits it doesn't really do anything. Got a villager again. Throw one on a cactus. Landed right on top of it too. So kind of cool the way that works. Got some glowstone here. We'll throw that into the cactus. And of course, diamonds, guys. Diamonds. You're not going to lose them to the cactus. I think a couple landed like right on top. I feel like I'm trying to do it now. They're like stacking on top of each other. It actually looks pretty cool. So yeah, the diamonds, they look amazing, don't they? Hold on. Should get a better view here. This might be a bad view. I think it's going to be better. We'll go like this and just toss them. Look at this. Look how amazing that is. I'm throwing diamonds all over the place, and they look so awesome when they land. And as you can see, cactuses are no threat anymore, except, you know, if you step on them, then that's bad. But other than that, you're not going to lose your items, which is awesome. And yeah, guys, that is about all there is to show with this mod. It's pretty simple, but it's really cool. It's actually pretty useful if you drop something in lava. It's not going to die. If you burn to death in there, you're not going to lose all your armor. So if you guys want to check this out, the download, as always, is in the description. And if you enjoyed the review and the commentary, be sure to smash that like button and subscribe if you're new to the channel. And I will see you next time for another Minecraft video.